And we are joined by Billy Wooden, defensive tackle for the Calvert Hall Cardinals as we lead up to the Brooks Financial Group Turkey Bowl, the 99th edition and your fourth and final yep. Turkey Bowl, correct? Yes. You're a senior? Yes. What's it going to feel like when you take that field at Towson University on Thanksgiving morning? It's going to be wonderful, especially to get, play one more time with my guys, the D-line, the defense. We got a lot of scenes this year, and we've been, we came up since JV, so it's going to be a great experience. I can't wait for it. And, of course, Calvert Hall is on a four-game winning streak in the Turkey Bowl. So if you beat Loyola, you sweep the Turkey Bowl for your high school career. Yes. You thinking about that at all? I mean, because obviously you want to do that. Yeah, there's a, it's a lot of pressure, but especially for this team, I think we do well under pressure, uh, dealing with the wise. Even with Mount St. Joe coming back down with 21 and um, really us strapping down in the second half and getting stops and giving, and giving our offense opportunity in different games like this past week against Avalon. Well, they, was, they was pretty good. They, they came out and kind of dominated the first half. Second half, we settled ourselves and was able to dominate and um, really stop and we held them to 16 points. You talk about pressure. How different is the pressure in the Turkey Bowl as opposed to any other game in the season? It's a big difference just because the the atmosphere and the, the tradition behind the game. So I think it's going to take a lot of a lot of effort and there's a lot of hard work and just dedication and just we got to focus up on practice just because we we kind of had a disadvantage with the game before. But we st we breaking up parts of practice to focus on Loyola on your Lo Loyola to help us with the game. So I think we should, I think we're going to do fine. So you talk to pe people ar uh, around town, at Calvert Hall and Loyola especially, they all talk about the alumni, and they all mm -hmm. talk about the feeling in school. Yeah. And they all talk about just random people coming up out of nowhere, out of the woodwork, telling each team to beat the other team. Yeah. What's that like? What are the conversations like with, with Calvert Hall alumni, with people around town that are telling you to beat Loyola? Well, take us inside those conversations. It's really just, really just the normal, just go out and dominate. But I really kind of just kind of block it out and just focus on the, the main point, and that's winning. That's what Calvert Hall is known for. And that's a tradition we want to live. We want to live by for um, to years on. So, yeah. so you head into uh, this Turkey Bowl as the favorites. You guys are ten and one. Loyola is six and three. But you know the cliches are out there that uh, you know you can throw the records out the window when you play a rivalry game, and this is the biggest rivalry game, arguably in mm. Baltimore. Yeah. What's it going to take to come out? by 1 p.m., mm -hmm. maybe a little after, on Thanksgiving with a W, another W, against Loyola. What's it going to take? Really just trusting the process, trusting our coaches, the game plan, and just the attention to detail, the small, the small things for us to execute. And then we should be fine. Just play together how we've been playing all season. We should be fine. I think last year you allowed six points uh, in the Turkey Bowl. Yes, I think it was. You've had some shutouts this year. Yes. Yeah. Uh, how badly do you guys want to shut out in the Turkey Bowl to uh, just get them, uh, not allow them into the end zone or through the uprights? Uh, very bad. I mean, that's, that's kind of always a goal. Our, our goal is to win and beat, Lo beat Loyola. So that's is, is a, a, a milestone on all of our books. So well, See if you can do it on Thanksgiving. Yeah. Thanks for coming in. Good luck. Your final Turkey Bowl, your final high school game will be there. And you can watch it on WMAR2 and WMAR2 News dot com slash live 10 a.m. on Thanksgiving morning, Loyola and Calvert Hall. We'll see you then.